What's up everyone and welcome back to my channel. It feels so good to be sitting down. I finally put makeup on for the first time in a week. I'm in my normal studio setup. It just feels so good to be back and filming this way. If you are new, hi, my name is Erin. It's very nice to meet you. Today's video is going to be an Amazon summer haul. So I picked up a lot of pieces the last couple weeks and there are some pieces that still haven't come in but I'm just gonna show you them on my Instagram when they do. I will link them down below for you guys. So since we're talking about my Instagram, make sure you follow me. I leave my handle right up here in the corner for you guys. It's at Erin Heartbreak. You can also like this video and subscribe down below to my channel. I have a whole notebook of content planned for you guys. So I'm really excited to just get the spring and summer rolling with some new videos. I'm gonna start with accessories. So the first accessory I purchased was a hat. I have a summer hat that my father-in-law found for me on the streets of Lisbon and I love it, but I wanted something that was whiter. So I picked up this hat and it wasn't though as white as I wanted it, but I definitely like that it's more of an ivory or an off-white. So it adjusts on the inside, which is awesome. I think hats are such a great day accessory. I would never ever recommend someone wearing a hat at night. I just don't think it's the time or the place. So I have been going through anklets like panties. I don't know what it is, but when I go to bed at night, I just rip my pants off and I take the anklet off with me. I must have broke four already. It's so, so bad. So I picked up another anklet off of Amazon. This one is really cute. It's silver and then it has these little beads on it. I was wearing a star one before, but I found that the stars were always getting stuck in the straps of my shoes or around the ankle part of my sneakers and stuff. And they were just cutting me up. So I'm really trying to not purchase trendy pieces or pieces that I want to wear but will never have a chance to wear. And then when I do have a chance to wear it, I already have 12 other options. I'm really just trying to save my money and stop shopping. So I have been looking at a lot of basics and I picked up this basic crop top. So this pink crop top was absolutely everything. It is a necessity. They sell it in 20 colors. I need to purchase it in every single color. It was just so nice and it was so affordable. So on the inside was almost fuzzy where it was warm, but not where you're gonna sweat. So it was a little bit thicker. The material was so nice. It was stretchy, but it wasn't see-through. So in this clip, I'm not wearing a bra. It's completely supporting my chest. I loved the length of it where it didn't look like a sports bra and it met my high-waisted jeans absolutely perfectly. I just think that it's an awesome basic. The neckline was so nice how it was the square cut. It had the same thing on the back. It's just perfect. So my friend was here the other day and <laughs> I took him for a tour of my house and he saw where all my shoes were and he just looked at me and was like Wow, you really don't have any color and it's true. I'm looking at my shoes right now I just reorganized them. They are all neutral or black. So I was thinking let's buy some white heels I purchased a pair of white heels and I'm not gonna lie. These are definitely not my favorite They don't have any grip on the bottom. So if you are walking around on wood floors they were definitely slippery. They are a shorter heel, but I feel like they're a great work heel. I don't see me wearing them out unless it's to something more formal or conservative like church. Just not the heel height that I like, but definitely a wearable heel. They did fit true to size. They weren't really wide or narrow. They honestly just fit me perfectly. This white bodysuit, I had high hopes for because the reviews were so great, but I ended up hating absolutely everything about it. I have already returned it. Um, you can wear it reverse, so to have the cutouts in the back, but it does have a zip closure, um, full coverage. I don't like that with bodysuits. It was also kind of see-through. Like, it wasn't bad, but you could definitely see through it. So maybe if you purchase it in a color other than white, you won't have that issue. And I also, again, loved the square neckline. I just think that it's so flattering and it's different than just having your basic scoop on a basic top. This striped dress was adorable. When I first took it out of the packaging, I was just like, oh shit, 
Here's another fail. What am I gonna do with this? It looked so see-through, but it wasn't. It was perfect. I think because it was linen, it's just a lighter material, but you couldn't see anything at all. I would definitely wear it with nude shorts underneath because it is really short and it's that skater style, so wind would take that baby up without a problem. It was a really cute length. It was super flirty and girly. It's a really great date night piece. It's so easy to just throw on. You can wear it with sneakers, you can wear it with sandals, you can wear it with heels, wedges, espadrilles. Honestly, the options are endless. Okay guys, two more items and one of them I am wearing. Sorry about that guys. So this white top I also returned. It is very see-through as you can see and it was just not as pictured online whatsoever. Maybe if you got it in a different color again it would be better in black but it just wasn't worth 10, 20, 35 dollars honestly so this was a fail for me. I tried this on first as a top for you guys, and honestly, how stinking cute is this? I love the Milkmaid trend right now, and I think the light blue just makes it a perfect summer addition. You can definitely wear this as a separate piece, or you can wear it as this set, which I am about to show you next. How cute. I can't. This, you definitely need shorts on underneath again, but... This piece is so adorable. It came in great colors. I think maroon and yellow as well. This is great for summer concerts. Honestly, I'm speechless. I'm literally stuttering. That's how much I love this. If this isn't the most Instagram dress you've ever seen in your life, I don't know what is. This dress sells for like $60 on White Fox Boutique, and I think I got it for $13 on Amazon. This is such a great vacation piece. Maybe you have photo shoots this summer. Pick this up. It came in black as well and is absolutely adorable and comfy. So this is an animal print bodysuit. It's super trendy and I'm such a hypocrite because I'm sitting here saying I'm trying not to be so trendy anymore, but I feel like this is a great piece. If you are trying to incorporate a trend, it's inexpensive, it's from Amazon, it's a bodysuit so you can wear it with a thousand different pieces, a thousand different ways. It came in a ton of colors so I really wanted to test it out for you guys. I love it, um, I feel like you could honestly wear it as a swimsuit. It does have a full coverage bum but because of the material it's so stretchy you can wedgie, wedgie that up your butt. So I think the print is really cute, it's animal print but it's not too much if you know what I'm saying. And it's a light pink, so you can kind of get away with it not being one of those neutral pieces. It's just great coverage, but it's still sexy. So this last dress is actually going to be a return for me. Maybe it will work out for you, but I was not a fan. So it just was kind of weird at my chest. It's hard to hide my chest. It's hard to not know that I have larger breasts. And the neckline of this and just the chest area did nothing for me. It made it really weird and awkward. Um, the dress does have a lot of great details. It's a super flirty length. I didn't really, I don't know, it just wasn't for me whatsoever. Okay everyone, that's going to be it for today's Amazon Summer Haul. Thank you so much for watching and I can't wait to see you in my next video.